Now, on the 25th of December 2021, that was Christmas. The world's most powerful space telescope, 10 million US dollar James Webb Telescope, was launched. And Kenya would join in the celebrations after a signal was picked up by a ground antenna at a space center in Malindi. Question, how does Kenya benefit from the space center? Our reporter Sarafina Robi traveled to Malindi and filed the following report. Here is part one of the two-day series. Located on the shores of the Indian Ocean, the Ligi Broglio Spice Center started in 1962. And the first activity started in 1964. Mainly the activity was only for launching from the, our platform. It is an Italian-owned spaceport near Malindi, named after its founder and Italian space pioneer, and jointly owned by the European Space Agency and the Italians. And with the recent launch of the 10 million US dollar James Webb Space Telescope will propel this space center to the limelight when it captured the telescope's flight to orbit for close to 30 minutes. The separation happened over us, okay? Malindi gives the first signal, and Malindi follow James Webb after separation for six hours. This jolted canyons and the world into a frenzy. Separation Webb Space Telescope, go Webb! The telescope, which is believed to be advanced with abilities to use infrared technology, will be used to explore an evolution of galaxies and how stars and planets were formed, as well as the mystery of exoplanets. And the origin of the star of galaxies and dark energy, and you see, this is what they declared. The telescope was placed away from Earth's thermal glow, with the moon and Earth behind it. Lagrange point L2, it means we are speaking about one million and a half kilometer, 500,000 kilometers from the Earth. So it should, uh, the telescope need 29 days to reach that point. The whole world is anxiously waiting for the first pictures. Uh, this uh, period will take at least five, six months or so to calibrate all instruments and uh, to be ready for uh, uh, scientific uh, uh, research activities. According to a tweet from NASA Web Telescope, the mirror segment deployments are complete. In a quest to understand more about the Malindi Space Base, we drove down to the nerve center of the action. The, posi the geographic position is very important because we are near the equator. Okay, so uh, all activities, all uh, launching towards the equator, Malindi is very important because after Malindi there is Singapore. Singapore is far away. According to the head of the Malindi site, engineer George Mokher, the center is in an intergovernmental partnership with Kenya. Last ratification was by Kenya in 2020 and uh, entered into force uh, in December 20 by the notification of ratification by Italian government. In 2020, the Kenyan parliament ratified a deal that was pitched by the then Amuhaya member of parliament, Wilberforce Otichilu, now Vihiga governor, and using the multi-billion dollar rocket launching facility. The agreement meant that Kenya will receive 25 million Kenyan shillings annually from Italy for the use of the land. So it is high time the Kenya government took serious interest in space exploration. The rest of the development in the world today is going to be controlled from space. Even travel, you can see the richest people like Ma Elon Musk and, and the guy of the, of the Amazon, they have already put up companies that are manufacturing spacecrafts that are already ready to take people uh, to space. Furthermore, the 25 million shillings deal will be reviewed after every five years. So they will be paying rent, uh, $250,000 every year uh, for the first five years and then subsequently every five years that will be uh, added $50,000 $50, on top. We will have access to scholarships, um, postgraduate scholarships, establishment of a regional center for earth observation. Sarafina Roby for Prime Edition.